And we're here at the China National Petroleum Stand, the China National Petroleum Development Corporation. Um, we're very grateful to have with us here the Deputy Director General, Mao Chiping, who is joining us. Thank you so much for joining us, sir. With the growth in population in China and, of course, the growth in demand for energy, tell me what your company is doing to meet this demand. Uh, okay, CNPC is uh, one of the largest uh, uh, oil company in China. Uh, so it's uh, uh, crude production is uh, uh, about you know uh, over 50 percent of the national total, and uh, so you know the uh, last year our production uh, is uh, over uh, 300 million uh, tons of oil equivalent, and uh, so you know the uh, as you know in the Chinese economy is developing very fast. Mm -hmm. I think in the past you know the 30 years the. Uh, growth rate is uh, above, you know, uh, nine percent, nine to ten percent. So, you know, the, we have uh, the big demand for the energy. So, you know, the CNPC is uh, trying to provide, you know, the more energy to the to the country and to feed its economy, the development. Of course, you are doing oil and gas. And um, tell us a little bit about shale oil. Shale oil is something that I know the Chinese developers are going to be looking at very closely. It could be very lucrative. Uh, Okay, the uh, shale oil, of course, in the, the, uh, now the United States is, uh, uh, has uh, made a big success with its uh, shale oil development. And uh, so in the, uh, many people say you know, China has a big potential of the reserves of the shale gas and oil. And of course, in the, the uh, CNPC as an energy company, especially as a petroleum company, and uh, we are now trying to uh, uh, you know, the, we're now actually say, experimenting with uh, uh, technology in China for the shale gas uh, development. And uh, I'm quite sure or uh, quite confident that you know, the shale gas development in China will be developing very fast. Now, you've met some very many of your colleagues here, I'm sure, today, and many of the international oil companies, the oil companies. How busy has the conference and the exhibition been for you? This is an important conference and exhibition for you to come to? Uh, yes, this is IP, uh, IPTC. Is, of course, is a, a, a big event for the uh, petroleum industry. Actually, you know, uh, the last you know, uh, IPTC was held in China, in Beijing. So it's uh, really a great success, uh, successful, uh, successful event. And so you know, the, it draws you know, the uh, expertise and uh, the uh, executives and uh, uh, technical people you know, to this event. And so you know, the, we are very happy to be here. And uh, our stand was uh, visited by many of the uh, peers from the uh, same industry. And uh, they show quite interesting the development of CNPC. And of course, in you know, some service companies, they, pr they try to you know, provide the technical and their technologies to our company. And uh, so we have many visitors. Yes, indeed. I'm sure all the services company looking to do business with you. Um, indeed. And of course, are you developing your own technology, your own research and training? Um, is this an area where you're putting a lot of emphasis for growing the Chinese um, young population to come into the industry as well, I'm sure? Uh, for sure. And it's, uh, because in the petroleum industry is uh, uh, technically intensive and in investment intensive in the industry. So in the, we CNPC in a pay high attention to the development of technology. Actually, you know, we give priority to the innovation, uh, to the renovation of uh, of this technology uh, in this field, and uh, also we try to, you know, to, to you know, the, to have uh, to attract, you know, more, you know, young talents uh, to our company.